Hello everybody, my name is Paler and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm gonna be showing you how to install Crystal Mod, but uh, this time is with the launcher. So I have uninstalled it so I can show you all how to get it. And you wanna go to your Discord, uh, join uh, discord.dj slash crystal mode and go to crystal mode right here. As you see here, you can check out the most recent patch notes and versions and you wanna go to uh, here to download you press yep it take you to this side this is basically the crystal mode uh, website and from here you can either buy a faction cloak a cloak for five bucks dollars and yeah here's our discord you can log into your account like you can authorize it to your discord and, and stuff like that uh, so yeah if you dislike mod, uh, mod.crystaldev.co it, it will take you here press download it will take you here and you can either get the windows installer or the manual install the manual install is basically the mod for forge and for Mac users because you cannot uh, run .exe files which is the installer I'm gonna be showing you how to download both I'm gonna be starting out with a manual install and it's pretty simple as my other video you can just download the mod right here just save and you will go to percent of data and you will get it right there uh, pretty easily uh, if you have any trouble check my, out my other video and you'll uh, find it this also applies to people that have problems um, downloading uh, the installer for example people may get an error while updating or something you can have uh, the manual installed temporarily uh, but for the latest updates so you can like get them quickly you just get a the windows and so uh, yeah for example right here it's 1.3 when there's a 1.3.1 out and it has been pushed to the launcher it has some fixes so yeah if you wanna it's better to get the installer okay so basically you'll download the installer and it'll begin to download then you'll either open it like that or just click on it Windows will tell you that um, it prevented it from uh, launching and I'll just explain to you why this happens. So uh, Windows Defender has a program called Smart Screen and this thing it checks out if the .exe installer has a purchased a, a license from Windows because like it filters most viruses that like when I get into your system but to get the license from Microsoft it costs I think $500 and we're not gonna pay that much for uh, free mode at least not yet for example if you don't trust this you can go right here and there was another client called PVP lounge and until very recently it did the same thing but as you can see, this is not a virus. They purchased the license and now it works. But uh, we're not gonna purchase it anytime soon at least. You're gonna press on more info, it'll go right here and you click on run anyway. And it will take you right here, you will do for all users or only for you. For example, in my PC, I want for only me, so I'll just click only for me. I'll click next and I will click install. Okay, now it's installing, it's launching the launcher and it will start installing all the, th the thing is, you will need to log in to your uh, Minecraft account and stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna log into my account, uh, I'll, I'll probably cut that because I don't want you seeing my email and stuff like that so yeah okay once you clicked uh, login it will say success and it will take you right here as you can see it tells you the, ser uh, the server status of Mojang and stuff so like you know if it's down or something you can go to settings and it will tell you your 
UI ID, your username, and you can add other accounts where you can log out. You can go to Minecraft and change your game resolution, which I'm gonna do, and set it to 1080p. And yeah, uh, you can go to mods, and as you can see, this is the required mods crystal mod and BRSK mod uh, thingy. There are a lot of optional mods that you can check and download if you want, uh, but I'm not gonna download them because, to be honest, I don't want to. I'll just get my own mods, but it's a good option for people. For example, I don't want better FPS because it sometimes crashes me. I want 1.7 hits, and that's basically it. I'll add my own Optifine. I'll add Optifine as well. Okay, you can click to add modes and you can add your own modes right here. It'll take you right here in this your mod folder. And it's not in dot Minecraft, so like yeah. And mo a lot of people I have seen just add duplicates duplicate mods. For example, like two times the Optifine or animations or add the schematic although crystal mode already has that and if you do that you will not be able to launch so yeah i'm just telling you so you don't do a mistake you can go to java and change your ram for example i want my ram to be six gigabytes once you're done press down and just click and play it will launch minecraft for you it will tell you that you need java so what you will do is go to java right here I think I had Java, but I'm not really sure, so I'll just download it again. Accept all cookies and Java download. I'll click install, and it's gonna be installing right now, as you can see. It's gonna take a bit, so I'll just speed the, speed the video up. Okay, as you can see, Java is installed, and I can just click play, and it'll start installing the, all the files needed for me to launch. I'll just speed this up too. As you can see, everything is here. And I'll explain the schematica because, like, people have problems. You just go open schematica thingy, go to printer, and I'll just show you the best settings. Zero, true, zero. You can change that to whatever you want. I have it five or like ten. I don't know, some service don't register the five thingy. And I just press done, done go here go here then press escape if you don't do that it basically won't save so uh, basically yeah <laughs> that's a thing and you can just search right here uh, whatever you want as you can see people complaining about fps usually i just don't know uh, as you can see have good fps and yeah, you can see my FPS are good. And yeah, that's how you get crystal mode. Uh, any questions, just make a support ticket. I hope you like the video.